so it is currently it's currently 9 45 a.m i got up like an hour and a half ago and i've just been like making my bed eating breakfast um term two starts today at ubc i'm just gonna tell you about my term or like what today's gonna be like um while i do my makeup so i've taking five classes this semester um, I'm in an econ program. I'm in international economics and I'm in my second year. Four out of five of my classes this term are in economics and I have two of those classes today and then a tutorial but since it's the first week um, I'm pretty sure I don't have the tutorial so normally my Mondays would have like two classes and a tutorial kind of thing. My class starts at 11 and then my it's an hour and a half long and then my second class and then my second class starts at 2 and ends at 3.30. And then normally my discussion, which I don't have today, will be at 4 to 5. Um, so yeah, normally I like preparing for my semester like beforehand by going through like all the courses and like looking at the syllabus and stuff and just like getting it all set up on like my platforms like my Google Calendar. But fun fact, None of the Canva courses, which is the platform that my school uses, was called Canva. None of our courses showed up until literally, like I think 5 a.m. this morning, and today is my first day of classes. So I think I'm gonna be doing all of that today, like going through my syllabus, planning the next few weeks, but like, I'll get into all of that. like a few other like first day of the term errands to run and then like I'm excited to see all my friends again I haven't seen them in like two weeks because of break um so that's gonna be really exciting okay makeup is done I was so excited to leave for class and then I found out it's raining and like, even if it's just drizzling, I absolutely despise the rain. Um, it's probably my least favorite thing about Vancouver. So even though class is only a 20 minute walk away, I'm gonna take the bus. <laughs> Just kidding, it's actually not raining yet. So that cheered me up like instantaneously. And the only way How was that? How was the first class? He loves words. words. <laughs> like, he just really likes talking, I guess. some chores. I finished both my classes for the day. My first class was like empirical economic data and stuff so I'm gonna be like doing models and regressions and then my second class is like international finance and trade. I'm now in fact on my way to Shoppers which is like a grocery store here. Um, I'm gonna go pick up some stuff that I need. I lose my stuff really easily. Um, so I bought some new headphones um, and didn't realize that they weren't for like iPhone jack. So I have to go get like one of those adapters. So I'm doing that. And then I actually lost my phone charger as well. So I have to buy another one of those. Um, I've been using like my roommates or my friends in class. So I'm heading to the exact same bus stop I was at this morning. I, um, I just take the bus everywhere actually. <laughs> It's called, it's like the 68. It goes like all around campus. And because I live on campus, it's like really easy to take. So I went to shoppers. They just didn't have what I needed. And so we're going to Staples, which was probably a smarter decision. I should have done that in the first place, but you live and you learn. It's weird how much a university is like running your own errands. Like I swear 40% of my time goes to like cleaning my room, doing my laundry, cooking, grocery shopping, 
like buying little things like this like you think you'd have so much more time to study because you're not in school for like seven hours straight and you like have breaks during the day but really it's just like you have to like take care of everything so that's like a fun little tidbit of information that I just did not know before coming to university. Honestly though, for me, one of the weirdest parts of a university was like how much you end up doing alone. Like your parents don't drive you to do like errands with them or like they don't drive you to school. And when you're at school, like you don't have classes with the same people all the time. So you're like walking to classes with like different people and it's so much bigger than like high school even. So even though in high school, you'll always know like one or two people in your class most of the time, like you don't, like you know nobody. So it's just like walking to class, going to bed, waking up, like you do everything alone. That's another like adjustment that took a long time for me. Like I missed my family because I just missed having people around when doing things. It's also such a gloomy day and I just checked the weather forecast and it's gonna be like this all week. That's great for first week of classes. It's really gonna cheer me up. <laughs> for dinner I made um red chicken curry and rice I'm just gonna eat it on my table oh <gasps> did you get your ears pierced it's in the end dude yeah oh my god that's so cool ice water what ice water I don't have ice I have water okay you can have cold water but I don't have ice no sorry I need to buy ice like an ice tray are you filming this so I'm in Staples and all of a sudden I'm like, I'm gonna throw up immediately. Except Diego's like taking his sweet fucking time printing pictures and I was like, but you needed a key to get in. So I'm standing there like praying for this man to look at me. I'm like, can I please have the bathroom key? Except I like couldn't speak because I was like, there was like vomit in my mouth. So yeah. I was like, <laughs> <laughs> and then I proceed to text Diego, hey bro. <laughs> <laughs> I'm throwing up inside That's of this right. Staples bag. <laughs> My friends just finished our movie. Oh my god, I'm so tired because I've been up for so long. That's basically the end of my day. I'm just gonna do some laundry, shower, um, maybe get a little bit more work done, and then head to bed. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, all of the fun YouTube things. And um, let me know what kind of content you guys want, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye.